Among the resolutions passed by the meeting of the National Executive Council of the Popular Front of India, there is one on demonetization and GST. Demonetization was one of the most foolish acts of the government. Demonetizing about 90% of, uh, of the currency available for the people. There was a claim that demonetization would be, would be finishing off the black money in our, in our economy and it will be draining the resources available to the terrorists and it will launch a new phase of prosperity and growth to the people. But this kind of grandstanding before the people, cheating the people and telling the people that this kind of uh, economic policies will be, will be helpful to them. And uh, Narendra Modi, the Prime Minister at that time, told in one of his speeches that if the people are unhappy with the demonetization, within 60 days of his rule, they can burn him. And uh, what, a, what a strange and funny comment made by the Prime Minister of our country. We have completed one year of demonetization and thousands and thousands of jobs were lost. Thousands and thousands of small scale industrial units were shut down and people are running from one place to another in search of employment. The resolution calls upon the government to apologize before the people and to remove all the obstacles that the demonetization has put on the road to progress and restore people's confidence and, and, and go for more progressive, more people-friendly economic policies. Another foolish act done by the current dispensation is uh, GST. GST is uh, actually governing tax in practice because in other countries we know that GST has been a successful experiment because there was only one level but in the hurry to prove that they are doing a historically important thing the Prime Minister and NDA government convened a midnight Lok Sabha session and passed the GST bill. It, it has been a total failure. People once again are confused. People once again are being exploited by, by the merchants, by the dealers, by the traders using GST to fleece the people. So just like demonetization, GST has been proved to be a total failure.